Hey guys, this is Gaston from Gonnet in Tennis. How are you again? Welcome to another tutorial, another video. Today what we're gonna talk about is something that we haven't done uh, yet. Volleys, okay? Something really important that a lot of people in the recreational advanced uh, level struggle. When they go forward, okay, they, they rally from baseline, they find the moment, they go forward, and when they get to the net, they don't know exactly what to do. Why? Because the problem most likely is coming from the footwork and how they, they keep the racket in front. Sometimes they go with the racket behind, okay? Or they do uh, this rotation here with the hips that makes them hit the, the ball or to the net or really wide. So one of the first things remember uh, to remember is the grip. You're gonna use for either forehand or backhand volleys, you're gonna use continental grips. Everybody knows continental, okay? If not, you can grab the hand here like this, take it to the side and arrive here. Always remember, we keep with the hand here, okay? The butt cap of the racket has to be inside of the hand. I don't want anybody like this, okay? Here, you don't wanna have it there. If not, you're gonna, the same thing we talk for the serve, you're gonna waste uh, the movement that you have in the wrist. So hand here, racket always in front, okay? With continental grips, wide standing, a little wider than your shoulders. I'm gonna show then a couple of, of, of bodies from the other side, but first I wanna get to the, to the technique. Okay, racket in front. So something very important when you guys are doing the volleys is to don't do this, okay? Most people tend to try to hit the ball hard so they open the racket back here without any rotation and then they close without any movement of the footwork. So first thing is racket in front. Once you do the split step, the racket is gonna turn with your body, okay? The unit turn, always in front. Always you have to be able to see the racket. So if I get sideways for you two guys to see, the way you do it is here, turning, and the racket always in front. It's very important, again, the cross step, okay? This is something that I'm all the time finishing, cross step, cross step. A lot of people volley from here, just doing like this. And they don't have balance because they don't move the legs, okay? They don't do the cross step forward. So very important here, cross step forward. When I hit the ball is now, in a couple of balls, you're gonna see how I do the cross step and how I fall with the racket at the same time and then coming back always to the middle. Okay, here, coming back always to the middle. Let's see how the ball is look. Okay, as you guys could see there, Two things that I wanna mark. First, when I hit the ball, okay, I'm gonna move over here so you guys see. When I hit the ball, I do the cross step and I finish here. You see my racket is almost coming back here. I see a lot of people hitting the ball, breaking their wrist here, opening and falling forward, or doing this and going down with the racket. What is gonna cause? The racket is gonna go, the ball is gonna go down to the net. The ball is gonna go like a love, long, okay? So very important here, split step, cross and finish, okay? Here, split step, cross and finish. As you can see, especially in the backhand, when I hit the ball, I'm hitting and my head is facing where the ball was, okay? I still look in there where the ball was and then I move when the ball is already bouncing and get ready, okay? Very important to do this recovery. I'm gonna go a little far so you guys can see. Do this recovery of hitting and then the split again. This recovery of hitting and then they split again. So you get ready if the ball is coming back and you have a second ball. All right, guys, I hope you liked the video, okay? If you have any, any comments, any thoughts, or any questions about, uh, about this or about the other videos like everybody's doing, you can comment. I always try to reply everybody and give an extra help, okay, if something is not covered during the video. Remember, if you're not subscribed to the channel, subscribe so you can stay tuned. And okay, keep up with the channel and know everything uh, that is coming up. Remember, connectingtennis.com, every video is going with a, with a little blog, a little text explaining and giving you some extra tips. Uh, very important, guys, when you practice the volley, when you are volleying in the match, okay, 80% of your mistakes are gonna come from this rock movement of the racket or a lazy footwork, okay? It's very important that you guys are always there, not thinking because you're in the net, you can be a little more uh, quiet or not moving too much, play more with the hand to be really effective in the net, okay? The best players in the net, they have perfect footwork and they're all the time they're on their toes, moving and getting ready for the ball, okay? Paying attention and looking at the ball until the last moment that they hit, 
All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed like I did. Thank you very much, and see you next time.